a Wikivide Documentaries production. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Enjoy. Infibian. Infibium Avenues Limited is an Indian internet and e-commerce conglomerate involved in digital payments, online retailing, e-commerce software and internet services. The company is headquartered in Ahmedabad, India. Infibium is an online retailer for books, electronics, and automobiles in India, and is listed on the BSC and the National Stock Exchange of India. Started in 2007, the company has offices in Ahmedabad, Delhi, Mumbai, and Bangalore, and has a total of 1,300 employees. Infibium launched an e-book reader, Infibium Pi, its successor Pi 2, and a media device, Infibium Phi. Infibium became India's first e-commerce company to file an IPO in July 2015. History Infibium was founded in 2007 by Vishal Mehta, a Cornell and MIT Sloan alumnus. After working for Dell and Amazon.com in the US for five years, Mehta returned to India in 2007 and started Infibium along with a group of Amazon employees. He funded the company by selling his personal assets rather than opting for external equity funding. The company was started with an initial capital of 100-150 million. Infibium.com started as an automobile portal in 2007, but later turned into an online retailer. In 2010, Infibium launched by India's first e-book reader. Acquisitions in 2008, Infibium acquired PicSquare.com, a personalized photo printing website. In 2014, it acquired Odigma, a digital marketing company, for. In 2017, it signed a memorandum of understanding to acquire C Systems, a provider of enterprise ERP solutions and customized software for e-commerce applications. In 2017, Infibium has merged with Kevenu, India's largest payment gateway by transactions. In a deal that valued the payment gateway at $289 million. Also, in 2018 Infibeam acquired Snapdeal's wholly owned subsidiary Unicommerce a cloud-based e-commerce order management software for 120 rupees crore. Lately, in May 2018 Infibeam Incorporated has acquired 100% shareholding of Avian International Limited the deal was valued $1.17 million. This made Vavian International a direct subsidiary of Infibium Globally Mir FZ LLC, a subsidiary of Infibium Incorporation Limited. Businesses Infibium's businesses include online retailing through its flagship website Infibium.com, e-commerce platform software service through Buildabazaar.com, e-commerce marketplace Darmal.com, and its own branded e-book reader. The strategy of Infobeam was described by Forbes as, that seems to defy most standard models. The turnover of the company was reported to be 10 billion as of November 2013. Digital Payments CC Avenue is one of the largest digital payment platform with operations in India. The payment gateway caters to more than 100,000 merchants across industry verticals including online retail, education, hospitality travel, and event management, amongst others. Online Retailing Infibium.com, the online retail website of the company, sells books, electronics and lifestyle products. The website has a selection of 12 million products across books, electronics, lifestyle, gifts and media. In 2011, the company established Infibium Logistics, its own logistics arm in major Indian cities. In September 2010, Infibium was among Economic Times top 5 digital brands in the e-commerce category. Infibium's acquisition of customer base at very low cost has been recorded as a B-School case study by Ivy Publishing. Infibium is the only authorized online seller of iPhones in India. Infibium maintains its best sellers list for books sold on the site. PicSquare.com, owned by Infobeam, is a digital photo printing and personalized gifts website. E-commerce platform Build-A-Bazaar is a SaaS platform built by Infobeam with operations in India and Middle East. 
The company initially extended its e-commerce platform to build online stores for high design, TTK Prestige and Crossword bookstores, and NDTV Shopping in 2011. The e-commerce platform was open to everyone through Builder Bazaar, which allows users to create their own web store. Builder Bazaar was awarded the Game Changing Idea of the Year award by the Economic Times at ET Retail Award 2014. The platform was launched in the Middle East region in 2014. It has 30,000 stores as of March 2015. Theme Jungle the theme store Theme Jungle is subsidiary of Builder Bazaar. It is conglomeration of different themes brought under one roof by Infobeam. The website was launched in January 2018 majorly to support Builder Bazaar stores. It is a marketplace of various themes designed by professional designers. Till May 2018, Theme Jungle has uploaded over 100 plus free premium themes. Music Streaming Platform Infibeam Digital Entertainment, a subsidiary of Infibeam established in 2012, builds music streaming and download platform solutions for music labels, brands and OEMs. In 2013, the company built Sony Music's Jive HD streaming and downloading app embedded in Sony's Xperia smartphones. Logistics Aggregation Platform ShipDroid a logistics aggregation platform was launched in January 2015 to provide uniformity of logistics services to small merchants across all courier partners. The platform covers 20,000 PIN codes across 600 cities. The platform allows merchants to choose mode of delivery such as surface, rail or air mode and also can opt for delivery commitment SLAs such as express delivery or regular delivery. Payments Infibeam invested $8.9 million in Payment Gateway CC Avenue in 2016. In February 2017, it announced further investment and likely merger with CC Avenue. In May 2018, Infibeam Incorporated invested $1.17 million acquiring the 100% stake in Vavian International Limited, a UAE-based payment gateway. Vivian claims to process of about 2,500 transactions with a transaction value of AED 2 million. Marketplace In August 2013, Infobeam launched the e-commerce marketplace Darmile.com in association with CC Avenue. Darmile has a selection of 15 million products. The website is built on Build a Bazaar platform and is also extended as a co-branded marketplace with 50 Indian banks. Infibeam Pi In February 2010, Infibeam launched Pi, an e-book reader that uses the ink electronic paper technology. Pi has a 6-inch screen with 8-level grayscale non-backlit display. The device has the capability to play music files, read Word documents and also supports 13 Indian languages. It has an internal memory of 512 megabytes that can store 300 books and supports external memory up to 4 gigabytes. The device, which is less than 10 millimeters, weighs 180 grams. Pi 2 In 2011, Infibeam launched the second version of its e-book reader and named it Pi 2. Pi 2 is a touchscreen device and has wireless connectivity. It has 2 GB of internal memory and expandable up to 32 GB through external SD card slot. The battery power is claimed to last up to 8,000 page reads. The company has over 500,000 e-books on its web store which can be directly accessed from the e-book reader through Wi-Fi to purchase e-books. Infibeam followed up the Pi 2 with an Android tablet called Fi. Financials and fall in share price 2018 Though the company had posted healthy profits after taxes in the previous two financial years, the company posted a net profit after tax of less than 1.2 crores in F's 2016-17. However this did not prevent its share price from continuing to soar up in 2017 and 2018 as stock analysts continued to forecast high share prices. Finally, on 29 September 2018, the company's share price crashed by 70%. From 212 rupees in the previous week to 53 rupees and 80 paise. 
after a WhatsApp message circulated sparking rumors of the company's poor financial health. Recognition In February 2018 Infobeam was distinguished by the Financial Times and Statista as part of FD1000 High Growth Companies Asia Pacific 2018. Infibeam ranked 418 among FT1000 high growth companies in Asia Pacific region. Infibeam was conferred with Consumer Durable and E-Retail of the Year Award at E-Retail Award 2018 by Franchise India held on 16-17 of April, 2018 in JW Marriott Hotel, New Delhi. At the same award function Infibeam's subsidiary CC Avenue was conferred with Best Innovation in E-Commerce Payment. Brought to you by Wikivideo Documentaries. Would you like to know more?